Another poorly kept secret in South African football is out. Serbian-born former Ugandan national coach Milutin Micho Sredojevic will return to Orlando Pirates as head coach after a previous brief stint in charge of the Soweto Giants more than a decade ago. He was confirmed on a three-year deal just a day after Shell Yonafret attended his resignation. Srede Jovic has his work cut out for him. He's inheriting a team which has been struggling for four men just came off their worst season ever. Pirates finished outside the top eight bracket on the Absa Premiership lock for the first time last season. But with a new man in charge, the Pakaniyas are optimistic. To say that I was not wrong the first time when I identified him. I was not wrong when I identified Rick Tinkler. And uh, so many of them. But I think he come with a good experience, uh, having you know traversed you know the continent. He understand the game. He was in touch with our game. He knows all the players in South Africa. He watches all our games. So that in itself come with the added value. Sreto Chevish has been working on the African continent for 16 years. He led Uganda to their first Africa Cup of Nations tournament in 39 years. In his first stint, he was in the Pirates' stuck out for just seven months. But he took the team to the semi-final of the CAF Champions League. The biggest uh, motivation for me is talent and quality of the players we are having. I see huge room for development and space for improvement inside them. The chairman also announced that the club captain Obama Nisa has left to join African champions Mamelo D. Sundowns. He left on a swap deal with a player yet to be disclosed. He has um, played you know, 52 games in one season. He was part of uh, the treble back to back. Uh, thereafter, he was involved in about four or five finals. Uh, also involved with two finals, you know, of the CAF competition. Koza added that the club will be further reinforced with quality players. It will be trimmed before the start of the 2017-2018 season. Mtutuzin Lovu, SAPC News, Soweto.